go on the road far from home again But you know I'd rather be by your side Another night of reaching for you when you're not there So I polish my words until I see you Oh my gosh. This has been a long while. Look at that. Just getting, uh, getting my mic moved around here. Hey, hey, hey. Don't you get, don't you get sleepy on me, Switch? Alright. There's a few things going on. Uh, there's Mudkip Community Day, which we're gonna prep, do some quick prep for while we gather everybody up real quick. Rana, she's gonna be like, let's pop it on. Oh, hey, we caught a, we've already caught a shiny. What's the, how good is it? Oh, that's actually solid shiny. Damn. Uh, one second. Thank Yaki. Oh, is that going to kill my... No, I'm still doing it. Let's see if this kills it. It does. I forgot about that. This is 75% though. I'm going to have to do all my calculations after. Whoo! Perfect attack on that one though. I am not unhappy there. Let me... uh start my phone uh, capture real quick. Go. 
Oh, shit. Yeah, well, I don't think we guys can do much with what I just sent, but we'll see. It's going to be unfortunate. Oh well, it gets recycled every time I reload it, so. Alright, so basically what I've got going on is I've got an auto catcher <clears throat> on my wrist that's going to uh, spin on these while I, uh, while I play Pokemon Arceus, but uh, might as well load up the Lucky Egg since we're getting triple XP today. Yeah, I think it's triple XP. Oop, no, we don't need that. It's only a three hour event. And I'll probably save that. Let's pile on some star pieces as well. Oh, well, that one's already caught or lost. I don't really know or care. Because this is a repeat event, it's really not that big of a deal. The next one's actually going to be grown. more of a focus. Because I think that one's actually... Stuffle? Freaking weird-ass Pedo Bear Community Day thing, but that's the release of the Pokemon as well. I don't think they've done that. At least they haven't done that in a while. If at all. There we go. Alright. And then... I'm gonna do this, actually. I actually have no idea, so here's the other problem. I have no clue where we're at in this. Uh, <laughs> it's been a while. Oh, do I have to really battle three more times? You son of a gun. Wait, how many more hearts do I need? Five. Nah, I'm good. Alright, I'm gonna do something real quick. I'm just gonna switch this over here. Don't mind me. Oh shit, the shiny off of the fucking uh, snapshot. Hell yes. Let's go. I have to throw on Pokemon? What is this nonsense? I better do that. Are you any good? No, you're awful, but you're huge. Does that give me enough? I think it does. Bro, come on. Do it. But I, I should have just seen it right now, right?
Yeah, it is. It's got a ribbon on it. I got it. I'm just waiting for that placard to pop up. Anyway, I wanted to get that done because current task involves powering up a Pokemon, and this is a perfect shiny Venusaur that I need to power up. Is it not going to give me the placard? Alright, that's fine. Whatever, whatever. We're just going to do this. Oh, not that high. We'll take it all the way to that. Boom. He big. How much did I eat my Stardust? Ooh, it didn't blow 600 fat. Or 6 mil, but that's fine. That's fine. We'll get back. Worth, too. That's the big one. But in the meantime, since we are now done leveling this fellow, he's been a great companion for the last like month and a half. I'm gonna go back to the training bummy. Speaking of, <laughs> if you're here already, then you know. What the fuck? Hold on. Let me check something here. Now does this work? to. I, I, now let me check on here. I'm going to check a setting here on my uh, capture real quick. Yeah, it looks fine. Alright, we're good. I'm gonna look a little too choppy for me. Alright, so we've got this done. We're gonna plug in my phone just so it doesn't die anytime soon. And uh set off on our Pokemon adventure, I think. Alright, uh, how do I do this again? Alright, who do I even have anymore? Let's just... Okay... Gotcha! Oh. Speak! Do you speak? It's a weird language, you sound like a phone. Uh, but, but it was... Okay, minus? <laughs> uh, request for my Meet Akari at the training grounds. Okay. A. Hey. Hey. We're moving it up. We're moving it up. Uh. 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 Oh god, wait, I gotta do voices. Fuck! <laughs> Get something in my throat. Hi, Dee Dee. My cat just walked in, like, what the fuck? 
Come here. Let daddy exploit you for the stream. No, no, that sounds so wrong. Sorry, I got my key. I'm gonna hold her ransom. We can do better. Hmm? <laughs> All right. All right, you can go. <laughs> Bye. All right. Um. Kari! Kari! Oh god. Oh my god. I even hit that middle... falsetto. Ugh, that was awful. <clears throat> Lubricate. Not a water. I'm gonna need to go do that. I'm intimidated by her right now just because I know I have to read her lines. Hi, Akari. Thanks for coming. <laughs> Jesus. Thanks for coming. I know you're busy. Listen, I had an epiphany. And that is? You see, I've got a partner of my own. We may not get along perfectly, but we've got to work. Together. <laughs> to keep, to complete the Pokedex. Your partner. Yes, here's my partner, Pikachu. Baga! <laughs> that hurt. I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> I shouldn't have done that and then had to go back to her voice. Hold on. <laughs> Let me re-attack. <laughs> when we were attacked. When we were When we were attacked by those shinks, I got too scared to think straight, and I couldn't handle p battling as a team. Ever since then, my partners refused to listen to anything I tell him. Oh, you fucked up. And if I'm being honest, I'm not even sure how to order him, how to guide him in battle. You suck. But when I saw how you and your Pokemon work together, I realized we needed to do more, too. So please... Have a battle with me. I want to learn how to fight effectively. I don't know what this bitch is doing, but she cry. Survey Corps Akari challenged you to a battle. Akari sent out Pikachu. Wait, no. Why am I using that as my main? I'm stupid. Uh. You suck. Wait, do you have, like, sleep powder or anything? Stun for? I have a feeling this thing's faster than me. Okay, well, that's... that's lovely. Look, I'm I'm boosting your confidence. No, 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 no. How do I switch the Pokemon? That's actually not what I want. Maybe it is what I want. The opposing Pikachu Thunder Wave hurts like a bitch. One more. Just one more. There. See? You suck. You and your Pokemon seem to be completely in step with one another. Hey, new move. Show me a new move. <laughs> Thank you for battling us. I could be wrong, but for a moment, I felt like Pikachu and I finally understood one another. It was until I switched Pokemon and whooped your ass. 
Let's keep working at it, okay, Pikachu? Uh-huh. I guess I was wrong then. But I'll strive to work more as a team with my partner, the way you do. Assuming Pikachu and I can bridge some gaps. Oh, by the way, the professor in the said Pokemon... <laughs> oh, by the way, the professor said Pokemon have things called types, which apparently make a big difference in how battles go. Pikachu seems to be an electric type, for example. No shit! <laughs> I'm not gonna go through it, but I know this pretty well. Alright, let's go... Oh god, who's this? I don't know what voice to use. What do I do? One does not simply voice question marks. So you're the one, the recruit everyone's talking about. <laughs> The name's Sizu, Captain of the Security Corps. I see you've got some fight in you. Figured I'd stop by and give you what advice I could. Captain Sizu is... Captain Sizu is a master of an ancient martial art. One that specializes in Pokemon battles. Now listen. If your Pokemon's truly mastered its moves, it can actually use them in different styles. On the one hand, you can choose to deliver a move in the strong style. The move will deal more damage, but afterward it'll take longer for your Pokémon to act. On the other hand, you can choose to unleash your move in the agile style. Such a move will have less power behind it, but your Pokémon can act more quickly afterward. In, a truly, in truly favorable conditions, it might even get out two moves before the opponent can act. Strong style moves, agile style moves, and of course, regular moves. Choose which is right for the given situation, and your Pokemon with a little nudge. And direct your Pokemon with a little nudge. Once your Pokemon has mastered a move, you can u have it use the <laughs> Once your Pokemon has mastered a move, you can have it use the move in either Agile Style or Strong Style by pressing the L or R buttons, or Left or Right button, when selecting the move in battle. Sometimes your Pokemon will naturally master a move and unlock these extra styles simply by leveling up. Blah 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 blah. Once one a waterfall. Oh, one oh, one more thing. If you want to teach your Pokemon some more powerful moves, just let me know. Caesar's teaching should serve you well when you're up against tough Pokemon. Now, I suppose it's time I went to meet Mai. You remember? I mentioned at the Wallflower that I could use your help with Mai's request. I'm a f <laughs> I'm to meet her down past the foot of the as got into I'm to meet her down past the foot of Aspiration Hill. You should come as well, once you've readied your Pokemon team, and perhaps had them learn some new moves from Zizu if you like. Yeah, okay, whatever. Cool. Gib move. Here are the training grounds. Your Pokemon can master their moves or learn new moves. Oh, that was not them talking. Hello there, Survey Corps recruit. Do you need something from me? I want new moves. So, which of your darling Pokemon do you want me to tutor? Uh... Special attack is definitely better. How much? I got money. That's pretty good. It's 
sick. Go away. How do I get there? Why not just to have it there for now? Cool. Where do I heal Pokemon again? <laughs> Don't mind me creeping around, I just forgot how to stand up. There we go. Uh, 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 uh. Is there anybody out there who remembers this game? <laughs> I'm just gonna catch this thing. Can't I, like, do it at camp or some shit? I think. I think that's how it works. Heading outside the village, are we? Stay safe out there, kid. Alright, whatever. That's where the mission is. Right? Is this the obsidian field? It's okay, it is. I just gotta make some quick uh, throws. Oh shit. Boo! Did I surprise you? I bet I did. I was trying to anyway. There's a secret technique to catching Pokemon, you see. It's what I call the secret back turtle strike technique. Hitting a Pokemon's back with your Pokeball will surprise it, making it easier for you to catch, but or making it easier to catch or giving you an advantage once the battle starts. Yeah, yeah, okay. If you're part of the Survey Corps now, working to create that Pokedex as they all are, you might end up meeting every last Pokemon here in Hisui. You should know I'm already looking forward to the day that you accomplish that. I have no idea what that was about, but okay, thank you. You what? Mate? Hold on, I need to check my Pokemon here. Well, they're all healed, okay, everything's fine. I want to switch out that Beautifly, though, until I get something going on. That's not the right box, is it? Don't give me that eye, Professor. Don't you look at me, you creepy old man. I don't want to voice you much. Alright, because what, what do you have to say, man? Oh, you're that boy from the Survey Corps who fell from the sky, aren't you? Listen, here, listen here a moment. I need to tell you about a great cake lure recipe I invented. Okay, sir. I call it the mushroom cake. I poured 20 years of mushroom foraging know-how into coming up with this recipe. I just know it's a winner. Sir. I fell from the sky. Let me catch this fucking Pokemon on go so I don't listen to anything else. We'll quick, we'll quick catch it. We need to get nice throws. We need nice throws. So let's, let's not fail. Whoop. 
We're gonna do this real quick so we can get on to the next step. Uh, That's why we keep those on. Nope. I what what all's here? No, I'm not voice acting him right now. Professor Daddy, no. I'll deal with the rest of that after we catch him. Who's inviting me to a raid? Why am I tempted to do that? Damn it. No. Maybe. Maybe I wanna. Maybe I don't wanna. Nah, I'm good. Alright. We're just gonna leave this in this position here. Let it catch Pokemon. While we continue reading this garbage. Problem is, folks around here just aren't catching on to my recipe's amazing potential. But you're the talk of the village. If people see you making my mushroom cakes famous as you are, I'm sure they'll want to give it a go too. I'll teach you the recipe. All you have to do in return is spread the good word by using it. Oh, and you'll need to go get the key ingredient for the recipe yourself. Scrounge not from the forages of thy fellows, as the old saying goes. One springy mushroom's all you need. I'll be waiting. Okay. I need to get a horse. Okay, what was that? I want it. My old back. Don't mind me. What was that noise? I snuck up on those leaks so good. Switch it back to this as the main view. Maybe not that one. Is that one not good? Is that one better? That one's better. Yeah, that one's a lot better. Alright, we good, we good. Oh yeah, I have to hit these with Pokemon. Thank you. What do you want? I see you looking at me weird. I'm a little off the beaten path, aren't I? Like, going completely the wrong way. I've gone farther away from the the destination. <gasps> but there's a thing. Pretty. Pretty bad. Pretty bad. Not great. It's a wormhole. Hmm. 
I don't think I can go across here. Oh, over there I can. Yep. Yeah. And they're like over there watching me do this, and they're like, "This, this is the like fucking Skyborn chosen one," and they're like, "You son of a bitch." I'm. There are many. There are many strong Pokemon that make that. I don't know what it was. There are, there are many strong Pokemon that make their home on the other side of this bridge. I can't let you pass in here unless you're a first. Oh. At your rank, you should be fine. Go on, then. Don't let your guard down now. Retreat to safety if you find yourself in trouble. It's like a derpy Kermit the Frog. I don't know how I feel about that one. Over here! My? This is Enola virus. I don't know how to do this voice. What am I gonna do with this voice? Oh, I need water. Okay. I got water. I'm gonna feel bad if Bumney's missing this because this is what they've asked for for like weeks, if not over a month. Well. Okay. I guess I'll just see how she talks. My, my, a new face in the village? No. My, my, what a way to start when your name is My. My, my, a new face in the village? <laughs> my, 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 my. Ah, ha, 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 ha. My, my, a new face in the village. Not that it matters to me if you're new. If you're here, I assume you're prepared to help. I assume you're prepared to be of help. Yeah. I am one of the wardens of the Diamond Clan. You may call me Mai. I suppose you might not even know what a warden is if you're new, new to Hisui. But such talk can't wait. Ah, but such talk can wait. Right now, I'd rather we be we get straight to the point. I have a problem that I need help solving, so the more important question is this. Do you feel confident that you can lead your Pokemon in battle? I do. Uh, yes. That's good to hear. The security core is the security core of yours certainly wasn't up to the task. This here is my partner, Munchlax. We were raised together like siblings. He battles at my side by choice without needing any silly little balls like you use. Watch and learn. Oh. Alright. 
Uh, just, just peg it with that, yeah. Ha ha ha. Your fat thing is dumb. Oh. Hold on, what does this do again? Hell yeah. Battle decided. Mom. You really aren't one of the usual galaxy buffoons. If you could use if you could defeat my partner. Well fought, Munchlax. I'll take care of the Pokemon that battled for us. And I'll let you have these. You people make all kinds of things with your crafting, don't you? These should prove to be useful materials. Vivichokes. You and your Pokemon fought well together. You practically acted as one with them. Rather like the legendary hero of old, the one we tell stories to of, our, of to our children. I think you needed you indeed. Uh, I think you're indeed the one for the job. You see, I need someone to deal with an alpha Pokemon causing trouble up at Deer Track Heights. It is a large, fearsome foe, like any alpha, but you'll come, won't you? To Deer Track Heights? Your arc phone is beeping. That thing you have, it's showing you where you've got to go, isn't it? My, my, that is a curious sort of map. Is that one of those galaxy team inventions I keep hearing about? It certainly does seem to show the way to Deer Track Heights up ahead of us. <laughs> exactly. I'll leave this in your hands. You'll do great out there. I know it. Bitch, I don't know what is going on. Seems you're quite the asset to the Survey Corps, new one. Though, before we continue, I must ask, do you already know about the Al about Almighty Sinnoh? Almighty, well, I'm... I suppose that's to be expected. Allow me to sketch out the basics. Almighty Sinnoh steers all time. It's said to have created the very universe using its power over time's flow, and this land of Hisui was born in the process. It's by the grace of Almighty Sinnoh that Pokemon can live and thrive here. We of the Diamond Clan are descendants of people who crossed the sea and settled here in the Hisui region to venerate Almighty Sinnoh. However, it stole away from the world long ago, hiding itself from our sight. Almighty Sinnoh has only rarely been seen by any human, if the old tales are to be trusted. But there are still Pokemon here today in Hisui with a connection to Almighty Sinnoh. And it is the duty of wardens like myself to attend to their needs. The Pokemon that graces Deer Terak Heights is one of those honored few. It is directly descended from a Pokemon that was blessed with Almighty Sinnoh's protection. Follow me, and you may understand. Hmm. Wait, what? Um, uh, what are you looking at? I don't want to do that, actually. No. All right, where am I going now? How you doing, Mara Jade Official? <laughs> What's up, Saxon? I played your song at the beginning of my uh, stream. I hope you don't mind too much. I'm trying to remember all these controls. Not much. 
much, my man. I'm just uh, playing me some Pokemans. <laughs> uh. That one's a sweep. I just want to hit it with a rock. I don't even want to catch it. I don't care if I caught it or not. I think I've already got one. Whew. Bjorn. Hold there. Mind helping a guy out? I'm after some cherry berries, you know them? Shiny red ones? They grow on some of these trees around here. I don't have any Pokemon that can reach them for me. That's where you come in, friend. Throw one of your Pokeballs at a berry tree and your Pokemon will grab berries for you. I'm sure the Pokeball you throw has a Pokemon in it, mind. Be ashamed to waste an empty ball. If you, uh... You hand me the three of those cherry berries you get, I'll tr I'll tell you a handy tip. Oh man. Um. Oh, could you give me three of those cherry berries you have there? Sick. Thanks. Now then, here's a handy tip as I was talking about. You can throw a berry near a wall Pokemon to keep it Yo, hell on, I haven't finished my tip. What? What? I know, man. <gasps> Geo, dude. Damn right. Ooh, give me a tumble stone. I can make more balls out of him. I don't know what that means. That looks like a flower. Pep up plant. Is it cocaine? Is it cocaine? Shit. Okay, well, whatever. I'm going to use that opportunity to get the fog out. Who was that? Break it open. Yeah, black tumblestone. Neat. What are you looking at? Get out of here. Bzz, bzz. No, no, no. There. I guess I probably could have just picked that up, huh? That one's moving. Get 
can I? That one was moving though. Wonder if we do it too far away. This is this is this is I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna spook you. Boo, boo. Fine. All right. You want a piece? You want a piece? You want to go? I'm gonna juke you. I'm gonna juke you. I didn't juke you. I'll come to you in a second. I need to check something out. Interesting. You're wrong. You saw nothing. No. Don't do this to me. I don't want to fall asleep. That was a nice nap, though. Thank you. Just ignore me. We're not... We're cool. Now he's like, the fuck? What, what even happened there? Poof! No, okay. Now this one's moving. Let's see what this one do. Might be something under it. A Geodude popped out. Beat the shit out of it. Uh, wait, no. That'll hurt. Noise. Uh. Grit, grit dust. I don't have space in my satchel for that item. Trying to th make room and none of these seem to want to work. I'm just gonna use. I'm just gonna. Good. Uh, yeah, it's a waste. I know, but whatever. I want dust. I want whatever dust is. Can I get fast travel, dog? Thing. So, your prof- Oh no. Oh, so even your professor decided to join us. <laughs> well, thank goodness I got here in time. 
And the Pokemon researcher. I could hardly miss out on a chance to observe an alpha now, could I? Did he just speak English? I suppose that's your business. Fine. As long as you stay out of the way. Ugh. This is Deer Track Heights. This is where I've come I've long come to pay tribute to a special Pokemon. A Pokemon descended from one of those ancient blessed by Almighty Sinnoh. Ancients blessed by Almighty Sinnoh. Delele whoop <laughs> Oh that's not it. That's only a troublemaker here to disturb the peace with its racket. Delele whoop <laughs> And that's what you're here for, Enola Virus. To drive that interloper from this place. I'll ensure your Pokemon are ready for battle. Abide my word. That's a large specimen. I can't talk like that today. Ugh. Little wonder Alpha Pokemon are feared across the land. As if... As... Uh, if they're all as oversized as this one. Exactly. They're not only big, though. They are strong and may know moves that others do of their kind do not. They're not to be trifled with, let me tell you. Nevertheless, I believe you are stronger still than this Alpha. So go show it that, beyond any mistaking. Be careful, you know, love I with. Size is a potent weapon in and of itself. No doubt this alpha is a powerful and hardy foe. If you must face it, make sure your Pokemon have some strong moves at their disposal. I don't care. I, you dragged me out here to beat up a big bug. Um. Yeah, I'm just gonna use my main. You guys stay here, alright? Go. Oh. Go get it. See, he's got it. <laughs> he ran away. <laughs> Hydrated. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. They did it to me last time and I couldn't keep up. I'm going to put a cooldown on it. You guys are going to force me to put a cooldown on it. Anticlimactic. I'm like, I just killed a Pokemon. Oh, shit. Seeing someone best an alpha like that, it truly reminds me of the legendary hero of old. We'd best make sure your Pokemon are taken care of after facing off against such a foe. I'm not even... What? What in the world? I'll train the boy. I will teach him the ways of the forest. It's the great... It is the great weird deer. looks upon you with kindness in all the virus what I'd say the great weird deer has taken a liking to you that is fortunate he is an esteemed Pokemon that can dash across the expanses of his suey while bearing a human on his back a human he deems worthy at least he is a blessing to all of us 
Remarkable. Truly outstanding stuff. A Pokemon wetting someone white on it. Why, it's just like the white Pokemon of a Woa. Professor Lavington, Enola Virus. Oh, that was the wrong character. I'm sorry. <laughs> Captain Celine sent me. She said that once Enola Virus carried out this request, we'd be able to set up a base camp. Ah, uh, about that. Ah, uh, I need to re read which character's talking. Ah, uh, about that. I know this was a joint decision by Adam and the commander, but still, it is truly fine for us to. S is it truly fine for us to set up a base camp? More base camps like this? Fuck my life, I can't talk. Is it truly fine for us to set up more base camps like this? This. The Hisui region is a land created by Almighty Sinnoh for the sake of its Pokémon. As long as your goal is to coexist and thrive together with the Pokémon, then I imagine you should also be allowed to use this land. The Great Weirder has taken a liking to Enola Virus as well. This is a good sign. You have my thanks for what you did today. Our clan leader will hear of how you aided us. I'll come to show you show my appreciation with a proper reward as soon as I can. Completed. Is it me or does she walk like she's got a stick up her ass? If we want to coexist and thrive with Pokemon, we'll need to stop fearing them and start getting to know them better. That starts with completing the Pokedex. Anyway, we should be able to have that base camp set up once the construction core arrives. Job's done. Here we have it. A new base camp of Hondia Twack Heith. I'll call it the Heith Camp. From now on, when you set out from the village, you can have to be escorted, escorted to this base camp to start your excursions directly from here. Having another camp, ba having another base camp to start from will be a great help in our surveys. Duh. Nice work today, everyone. What say we all head back to the Wallflower? To read these things over, like, over and over a few times just to process it. Cool. Oh, I got research level 10 on that now? Cool, what are the odds I can see a shiny then? Not at all, because I don't know how many more I can catch of that guy. Oop. We should probably check in. Oh. Benny, old chum. The usual potato mochi, please. And make it for, uh, for three of us. Three today as well. TV. What are you doing up here? I'm gonna chase you off. Your vacuum. Have you all heard the grave news? I don't remember this character's voice. That frenzied Cleavor from the rumors, it ended up mauling some of our galaxy folks who went out to investigate it this morning. The medical corps has had a hard time getting all the injured back on their feet. Or finding where one limb ends and another person begins. It was a massacre. There was blood everywhere. There was so much viscera. The carnage was... It was palpable, literally. Ah, this is the Cleavor from the reportedly... That were... <laughs> Ah, this is the Quivor that was reportedly struck by powerful whitening, yes? I did hear it. he's been behaving most erratically since then. Still, the further investigation is in, if further investigation is in order, the Survey Corps will, of course, step up to the task. A certain amount of danger is inevitable when researching unfamiliar Pokemon, 
But I'm sure you know if I was here can handle things just fine. Are you certain? I've heard Cleaver is so mighty even Alpha Pokemon don't compare to him. Now, now, you forget that the strength of Pokemon are key items of information that we have the survey core, core are duty bound to research. And since this perilous work of ours calls for queer heads and fighting pits, fit physique, I do believe a good night's sleep is in order after this fine meal. I want food now. Now I'm hungry. The next day! Good morning, you know, virus! That sounded almost like Booper. <laughs> you should hurry to the commander's office before she, he decides to use you for sumo practice. Uh, I hate my hair. Nah, it's pretty accurate, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. Wait, hold on. Let's hurry to the headquarters. Well, which one was adamant? Look who's being punctual. <laughs> Finally realize you're wasting almighty Sinnoh's precious time bowing to a sham? All this. I need to... Uh. Oh my god, I'm not ready for this. <clears throat> how do I do this? How was? How did I do this? I forgot this voice entirely. Give me a second. I need to do, practice some things without bottoming the mic out. go again, insisting on your false image of Almighty Sinnoh as ruler of time. My people follow the true Almighty Sinnoh, the font of creation, ruler of space. Ha! Huh. You can only have all the space there is and still not know what to do with it. Excuse me? Are you really suggesting that you make better use of your time than we make of vast Hisui space? Better than some. It's a miracle you showed up on time, oh mighty leader of the Pearl Clan. I was I worried you'd get lost in the pointlessly vast space you're so fond of, and never show up. Me? Get lost? In Almighty Sinnoh's great gift to the Pearl Clan? In our world's very basis? You wish. <laughs> I wish that I hadn't let myself get dragged into arguing with you. Almighty Sinnoh, forgive me. What a waste of time. I'm off to Commander Commodo's office. I must have read that as Commander Com Commander Commando. <laughs> Alright. 
I'm off to Commander Komodo's office. I believe it was you who started this. <laughs> and see him. You can really, you can feel the tension when those two show up. You haven't, <laughs> you haven't met them, have you? The woman in, the woman with the reverence for space is Irida, leader of the Pearl Clan. The man who is going on and on about time, Adam, and leads the Diamond Clan. The Diamond Clan and the Pearl Clan grudgingly co coexist at the moment. Apparently things used to be less peaceful. But the boss, I mean, the commander, is waiting. We should save this conversation for after you report to him. Sure. Do you think I look alright? Do you think I look prepared for this meeting? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Shit. I forgot. Parrot. Do this. Do, do, do the thing. Come on. But. I didn't expect that cutscene to start so quickly. I'm hoping that this will actually be the last bit of the main tutorial, like, area, because... Yeah, it's taken me way too long. Alright, we're back in business. And it was a shiny... what is it? Is it any good? It's not very good? I'm just gonna leave that there. Raking in some, some mud kips. We're gonna go, uh... Into offices. If you have progress to report, I will judge its worthiness. Show me your Pokedex. Uh... I, I have no idea what you want from me, Selene. Oh. Oh, I, d I don't want to take any requests right now. I just want to go on, on, on this adventure here. Upstairs. Wait, what do you want, lady? Wait, no, I don't want to do any extra requests. I don't talk to the help. Ho! Oh! What do you intend to do about that cleaver, Commander Commodo? He may be descended from a warrior of Almighty Sinnoh, but look at the mess he's causing. We can't sit back and let him rage on. You do get right to the point, Adaman. Time wasted is lost. Well, tell me, what would you have us do? Cleaver is a precious lord of the Pearl Clan, is he not? That's the point. My clan is, can't intervene directly where a lord of the Pearl Clan is concerned. If my people were to do something, that was the wrong character. If my people were to do something, our two clans might end up back at each other's throats, just like we used to be. What do you... But even folk of the Galaxy team have been wounded, haven't they? Someone's got to do something here. Who then? Would the Diamond Clan have the Pearl Clan bring... one of its own? Bring down one of its own honored nobles? I don't believe I said that. Thought it, maybe. You might as well have said it, you fool. Look, we don't have- we don't even know what drove Lord Cleavord into such a violent frenzy. 
I'd like to know that for myself. What the heck? This is... This is a first as far as my clan knows, too. Hmm. I see you've arrived. This is Enola Virus, the newest member of our Survey Corps. Uh -huh. I hear from my you've earned Wardier's favor. Good to finally meet you, stranger from the Rift. I'm Adaman, leader of the Diamond Clan if you want to be formal. But that's a mouthful. Just call me Adaman. If you've come from beyond time and sp the well, if you've come from beyond the space-time rift, could you be from space where Almighty Sinnoh is said to reside? I'm Irida, leader of the Pearl Clan. Caution and foresight are my watchwords, which is why I have trouble believing such a tale. Could you have really passed through that rift? I have a proposition. Why not send this one to study Cleaver before deciding what's to be done? You'd send this stranger who supposedly fell from the rift to study Cleavor. This newcomer with no experience. Says the leader with almost no experience. Being a good leader isn't a matter of time, it's a matter of embracing Hisui's vastness without fear. Well then, there you have it. I have if how you yeah, if how new you are doesn't matter, then let's give this kid a chance. I'm sold, Commander. Let's try this your way. This should be fun. I'll get to see how good you you galaxy folk really are with all your weird ways. Putting Pokemon in those strange balls with what you ha- and what have you. That whole practice bothers me. Almighty Sinnoh made Hisui vast so Pokemon could live freely throughout. We're meant to stand alongside Pokemon, not count ourselves above them. We do not use Pokeballs for a desire to control our Pokemon, only so that we can live together. Allow us to show you what we can do. This is your mission now, Enola Virus. I order you to study Cleavor and keep and help us find the truth of this situation. And. <laughs> Uh, can I remember that you are a stranger who appeared one day out of a very, out of the very sky above us. People are naturally suspicious, suspicious of your presence here. If you wish to be fully accepted and trusted, you must work hard. Work yourself to the very bone. Well, that's settled. There's no time like the present. The Lord of the Woods, Cleaver, is descended from a Pokemon that was blessed with Almighty Sinnoh's own power. Now, no other Pokemon you've encountered can compare to its his strength. Be warned. They keep losing their voices. Listen to me. The Galaxy Expedition team has come to the Hisui region as a group of outsiders. Some might even call us interlopers. We mustn't do anything to threaten our relations with the Diamond and Pearl Glands. Understand? Join me downstairs in Omavirus. We'll cover the details of this new mission. I am a confused young lad in a distant land outside of time. Fuck off, maid. Ah, oh, good. You already heal. <laughs> Professor Laventon, this briefing, if you please, the briefing, if you please. Of course, he gets to deliver it. Yes, let's get white to it. So we blah 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 blah. I understand that you've been requested to find out the, the cause of Quivor's frenzied state. But, as you're aware by now, Quivor is a mighty thing. Nigh invincible, even. 
the security caught twice throwing Pokeballs at Quibor when they were attacked. But I'm afraid they didn't even come close to catching him. It seems he's a far trickier opponent than even those aggressive species of Pokemon. They can all be caught outside of battle once they, they're wild. I'd like to be perfectly clear on this point. The mission will put you in extreme danger. Do you believe you can handle it? No. <clears throat> well, you have no choice. Let us go over the details you need to know. You have a mission to carry out. The Diamond and Pearl clans revere their nobles because they believe these Pokémon serve their almighty Sinnoh. They leave offerings to express their gratitude to these Pokémon in locations they call Noble Seats. They are strange humans. So perhaps a good starting point for our research could be to find out what sorts of offerings they've been normally weaving for this Quibor. In all of Iris, we need to speak with you. Listen, that rift in space-time seems like it connects this world to a whole nother world. That would... That world might be where Almighty Sinnoh itself resides. The true Almighty Sinnoh, that is. The one that rules over time. If you fell through the space-time rift, that might mean you traveled through time by Almighty Sinnoh's own power. Think of it. You must have been swimming in the div its divine might. Well, I got a favor to ask of you, oh amazing time traveler. Don't just study Cleavor. Quell his frenzy. Well, you certainly caught us at a good time, young Adamant. We were just discussing our next steps regarding this whole Cleavor situation. Oh, you must be that Galaxy Team Scholar I've heard so much about. Good to meet you, Pro Mr. Professor. Share some of that knowledge with me sometime. Now, let me elaborate a little. Those Pearl Clan types have a lot of respect for Cleaver. You heard his title, Lord of the Woods. I'm sure they'd rather get this under control too. But it's hard for them to come right out and ask those of the Galaxy Team, of all people, for help. And the truth is, we in the Diamond Clan have a similar problem on our hands. A Pokemon dear to us off in the mountains has flown into the same type of frenzy as Cleaver. Now, there's certainly bad blood between us and the Pearl Clan, but still. You've got all the... <coughs> Pardon me. We've all got to share Hisui, and that means we've got to tackle our problems together. But there aren't many capable of standing up to such powerful Pokemon. You're the best hope we've got. You'll find Cleavor and Grand Tree Arena. That's at the very heart of the heart... Wood. That's in the very heart of the Heartwood. His warden is a boy named Leon. Leon is a brilliant child, but also a bit, well... Sometimes brilliance can be blinding, you know. He'll tell you all about his beloved Cleavor, whether you wish him to or not. Anyway, I'm sure you're up to the challenge, so we'll be counting on you. See you later. Oop. Bump my mic. He certainly left quite quickly once he finished talking. I suppose he really values his time. Adamant and my words weren't wrong, you know. Adamant and my aren't wrong, you know. If you're to study and perhaps even quell Cleavor, you'd best start visiting his abode. Our new heights camp would be a handy place for setting out towards Grand Tree Arena. And you should stop by the pastures, too. You'll want to choose the best Pokemon to bring. But, uh, I don't want it. Baggin. A 
Okay, gotta do what I used to do. One second, before we turn the camera. Why do they gotta do it like this? Why do they gotta reveal everyone with a voice? Bagging. It's just a dude. <laughs> Someone's like, that theory is like, Pokemon Legends Arceus. That real villain is the satchel upgrade guy. Oh. If that sounds like you, it'd be wise to lend me your ear a moment and hear what I have to say. I don't sound a thing like I look. Who wouldn't like more space in their satchel? You can carry around even more in that satchel of yours if you learn the trick of packing things in. I can teach you if you'd like. What do you say? Teach me. I, yeah, I don't. We'll pay a hundred. Perfect. Then lend me your ear a moment. Okay. How much is it going to cost? It's going to go 200. Let's just keep upgrading our bag. Let's get at least like five or six slots. 500? No, 300. All right, all right. I don't mind this. At least it's not like exponential. That would suck, but. So I'm just going to rank through this. our bag by five spaces what what you son of a bitch first five are cheap and then it goes up like no I I see I see your scam now mister and your funny hat and your dumb shoes I gotta fight this thing first. We're gonna do a thunderous raid real quick with these people. Oh, why did it fucking. Oh, that's good. Gonna keep ramming on this thing while we uh, move around. All right. Um. Oh, that's my waypoint. Let's look at the map. Burn it. Dodged, bitch. Hell yeah, it didn't even take one of my Pokemon out. Deal with it. Alright. Uh, can we zoom out? Yeah, okay. I was in first person for a moment there. I look beautiful.
Oh, they're getting rid of the channel views thing. Uh, in four days. That's interesting. I'm just shy of 5,000 channel views. It's kind of cool. Oh, Volo. One second. Let me catch this thing first. Stop zigzagging and throw an attack. Thank you. It's gonna keep busting out though. Yeah, that was a good start though. Keep that shit up. Let's go. Come on, you weird mutant genie. Oh, that was turds. How are things, my good friend? I certainly hope you're putting that secret backstrike technique I taught you to good use. Either way, I have some super potions here just for you. Oh, thinking of it, having the Survey Corps out and about studying Pokemon is great for business, you know. Supporting you now is actually an investment in my own fortunes. I am an influencer, and now I must depart. There are ruins that are just calling me, and I'm off to invent raid shadow legends. Now. I think we're gonna scope out this gate. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're going to... What happened to our... Is this our... Oh yeah, ice can. There we go. Oh, that was close. That was, I think that's still a great circle, though. Eh. I need to store items. Come on. Yeah! All right, let's toss shit in here. Wait, hold on. Good shit. Alright, we're gonna throw that in there. Oh, for revives. Ooh. Serious girl that can raise the effort level for one of the... Oh, that is important. I'm glad I stopped and picked that up. We can raise EVs. I can raise the effort value. Jesus Christ, that's really strong. I didn't know that was what I was picking up. I'm glad I did. I should have sold this. Why didn't I sell it? Okay, we're moving on. Moving this in all at once. I 
think we can craft from the storage, right? If I remember correctly. Yeah, it can. Mmm. There we go, if shit gets real, we're ready for it. Uh, right, ready for it. What was that sound? Wait, that's where I'm supposed to go? Huh. Okay. And how the s Okay, there's land bridge there, I guess. How the shit am I supposed to do this? Like a boss, that's how, that's what we do. down there he's a good I'm go sneaky sneaky what the hell happened to it what was that what was that shit did it just get possessed that was not what I intended to do Trees and not good. Oh, okay. Ow. These guys don't fuck around. Jesus. Uh. Guys, I got a world to save or some shit. Just leave me alone. What is that? Oh, it's Cricket Hot. That's not what it looks like. Don't mind me. <laughs> the fuck was that? Did I s see this as a land bridge? Is that actually true that this is a land bridge? Oh, whoa, the barrel is huge. Oh, it's an alpha. Oh my god, it's an alpha, the barrel.
there's no way. Yeah, no, there's no way. That's terrifying. I get it to flinch. That's okay. I can use the next Pokemon, right? Perfect. What? Come on, let's do this. Yeah! Yeah! We got our first alpha, boy! Get up. We got an alpha. There's still no shinies, though. There's some iron over there, too. Good iron farming over here. Let's go. Get it, get it, get it. Here I am just running them through. What's that? Dazzling honey, all right, cool. Just some passive leveling as we make our way up. Grab that. Can I grab that? It can. Neat.
that one asleep? Is that why it's doing that? Or is it drunk? Oh, <gasps> I see Buneeries. What is happening over there? Why is that so shiny? There's something in it. <gasps> oh yeah. On it. You aren't mad at me, are you? I don't know what's up there. Come on. Why is that so fucking shiny? Oh, it had stardust in it. See where that bunny went. Oh, what the fuck's on my butt? A Psyduck! Good Christ. Doors, take it. Suck it. <laughs> Fine, we'll do it this way. And yeah, we'll use Gust. Let's try not to kill it, I want it. Yeah! We got a Psyduck. Bunnies!
I'm just gonna keep feeding them. They're just so cute. We can both have one, all right? While I kidnap you. Too bad. Son of a bitch. Is that a cascoon? Is that a silicon or a cascoon? <gasps> your big brother in my pocket why do I have that look on my face like uh ooh honeycomb oh is this bunny now sleeping alone under a tree is it even a bunny oh my god I won't let it sleep out alone. I know I've already got one, but I'm just gonna hit it with a rock. You can go hang out with your friend. Without being spotted, I think that's generous. Alright, up the hill. It's a wormple sleeping. It's actually kind of adorable, I'm not gonna lie. Awesome. It's a oh I can evolve that one, I need that. Uh do you just hypnosis it. Use hypnosis. Damn it. Oh, 
Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, I don't know what else to do but to hit it with more rocks. <laughs> Hey, there we go. I can evolve it into a Vespa Queen. But first things first, let's, uh, no, not that, not that. Let's do the. That's enough for now. Don't want to get, like, thinking of his favorite or something. You guys shut up and leave me alone. What are you looking at? I don't got any more room for your kind. Actually, I don't know that. I actually probably should catch as many of yours as I can. I can do it from here blind. Nope. Uh. That was not on purpose. Oh. I'm trying to be some kind of Pokeball sniper over here. Might as well. This is actually pretty badass, not gonna lie. I have achieved a new level! <laughs> Alright. I believe we are almost ready to fight Cleavor here. What's over here? I wonder. There is nowhere to run, Bunny. There is no running from me. Ooh, piece of metal. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Huh? I hear one? I think I heard one. That's a shinx. I guess I want up here. Just need one. Nope, none of those are things. Ooh, I will take that though. I may have been mistaken at what I saw. Hi. 
Yes, run, tell your hive. I've come for their souls. What is that? Just wood. Alright. I have found wood. The most dangerous Pokemon in the game. Wood. There's one. Going for it. I try to get this. I don't care. ADD. Oh boy. Here's a kid. <clears throat> There's a little kid. Oh boy, here we go. Here we go. I'm Leon of the Pearl Clan. The Warden to Cleaver, Lord of the Woods. And you, I've already deduced that you've come here to meet Cleaver. Am I right? I'm right, aren't I? Of course I am. I can see it so clearly. After all, the powerfully awesome Cleaver had just become more awesomely powerful. Perhaps that strange lightning the other day was uh, Al Almighty Sinnoh's divine power. But whatever it was, it stuck. It struck my lord and left him imbued with awesome might. So I must turn you away, even if it plain, even if it pains me. It's too dangerous for you to meet Cleaver right now. Oh, well, that's that then. Bye. Truly, you mean to simply give up? Is your passion for Cleaver so paltry? But well. I'm afraid your passion is not the real issue here. I've been told no, in no uncertain terms by Irida that I'm to let no one near Cleaver. I will fight you off myself if you insist. If you wish to avoid battle, withdraw now, while you still can, or face the wrath of my Gumi. Uh, I'm going to bow out. What a weird-ass kid. I don't want any part of this shit. I'll wait. If I don't do this, I get thrown out and starved to death. Or get eaten by monsters. Alright, let's do this. Like, whatever, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shut up. I'll take you on, kid. You don't even realize I'm turning you... You don't even realize I'm turning you away for your own safety. How sad you are. Go, Gumi, and see if you can ooze some good sense over this foolish troublemaker. I hate this kid. I hate this kid. Oh. Uh, I guess we'll fight. Water dragon or some shit. Whatever, we'll just bring out Alexia. He's whatever.
What? Yeah, I mean, might as well just finish the fight with that, right? Oh. I get hit with acid. But he got hit with death. How can this be? I may have been defeated, but my point still stands. It's too dangerous to meet Cleaver now. The only welcome you'll get is if you approach him is a f the only welcome you'll get if you approach him is a flurry of devastating blows. Normally, I'd simply try making him an offering, a nice heaped helping of his two favorite food served up with respect by his loyal warden. That's me, of course. It's usually enough to please him and soothe the prickliest of moods. But even I, Cleaver loyal, Cleaver's loyal warden. Can't get close enough to off give any offerings now. Not with the way Cleaver's rampaging and running amok. There's nothing an outsider like you can do. Fuck, I forgot her voice. The ancestors of Cleaver, Weird Deer, and their cohort drew something on Almighty Sinnoh's own power to protect Pokemon and people alike. So it said. It's by their grace that our clan, e that any of us, still lives in Vastasui today. Irida, what are you doing here? I'm here to talk about space! As you say, Cleaver has grown even stronger, but I'm afraid that strength poses a problem for us. If he was indeed struck by that lightning, could the bolts have been sent by the false Sinnoh that the Diamond Clan bows to? Cleaver means so much to our clan. I'd hoped we'd br we could bring this situation under, our under control ourselves, not throw our hands up and ask some outsider for help. But we must save Cleaver from his frenzy. Every moment it continues, the danger grows. If more people and Pokemon are attacked, it will lead to conflict with both the Diamond Clan and the Galaxy Team. You, stranger from beyond the sky, tell me, could you Galaxy people actually fix all this? Could an outsider actually find a way to quell our Lord's frenzy? Oh. Your commander tasked you with investigating this mess, didn't he? Leon and I will gather food and please Cleaver in help, hopes he might be able to get close. Enough to make him a proper offering. As for you, find a way to quell his frenzy, even if you to search every corner of Asasui. I guess. Alright, that's my job now. Oh. It's a DoorDash guy. Hey, my pizza's here. So that's where we're at. That's that's where I think we're going to leave the story for today. And uh, on that note, you two are annoying to voice. I am going home. Oh wait, I'm just gonna. Forget how to do anything. Uh, I think I can save from here. And we'll continue this again. I actually, this was cool. Yeah. I want to try to do these on Mondays, but like, I don't know. Either way, I might be coming back later to do something else, but. This is all I, I think this is a good chapter in the two hour block. Lots of new voices. All of them annoying. Those people back there like who was he who was he talking to? What was that thing? And I'm just like Why is he dressed like that? Is that a he? What is that?
know why I did that. I was trying to do something else. Oh, oh wait, I know what I was trying to do. And now it never hits the ground. <laughs> That's actually all I need to check out. Oh, we're missing out on a few. Let's let's see what we got. This is partially what I need to go focus on. Are any of these any good? Nope. What the fuck? Are you seeing that glitch there? <laughs> Why is why is Gr why is Grendel in front of all my Pokemon? What in the fuck is going on? <laughs> what is this? A praise. There we go. Now we can at least check all these. What the. Fuck? Fuck. I can't really see what's shiny and what's not, but I don't see a lot worth keeping. So it should make this kind of easy. Transfer 10. Some of my favorite Pokemon. Seriously, Mudkip's one of my favorites. Like, absolutely hands down. I just want this in the background for a minute. While we get this last step. And then I'm going to head out and finish the last of this. <laughs> Why the fuck is it like that? <laughs> All my Mudkips are... Fucking Rhydons are right. Wait, what is that one called? I forget. <laughs> Rhyperior, that's what it was. Alright, we got through those. Let's collect the tasks. Yeah, you know what? I'll get you in a second. Oh, fuck off. I didn't mean to press it first. Maybe one of those two was good. Did I finish that guy? Yeah, I did. So, three great curveball throws, evolve one marsh. Don't. Okay, well that's easy. Let's just do it now. Let's get it all done. One great throw. Can I, can I get another Pokemon here? There we go. Two great throws. That was a nice throw. Not a great, but oh well. I'll grab this one. Great throw at all. 
Hey, there we go. Alright, we got through those. Now we need to transfer 10 Pokemon again. No, 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 and nope. Garbage, 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 garbage. Fine. So here's what we'll do. We'll go da 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 da. And then evolve one marsh stump. This one's probably just straight up too big to do anything else, so I might as well. We'll see how fast we can get it all done. God, that's a beautiful Pokemon right there. Beautiful Pokemon right there, I tell you. Alright, and next task. Got it. Got it. Collect it. No, this is all just stuff. We've completed it all. Hey. Ta -ta, ta -ta. And a marsh stomp for the end. Will it be a shiny evolved marsh stomp? Like, I love that idea. Let's, uh, I like the idea of it completing. <laughs> Why? What? <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. I think I did just set it on fire. Look what I did to it. It's just stuck here. Uh... I need to restart that. But I'm not going to leave you hanging. One sec. One sec. Okay, I think we're back in business. Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> what is up with Venusaur's fucking profile picture? It's like he's looking back at you through the peak hole in... No, it wasn't shiny. Go figure that. Oh, okay, well, such is life. Ding, 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 what's that? Okay. Okay, so we actually got through the research for the Mudkip event, it looks like. Yes, 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 okay. Alright. We're all good. And I'm out. So peace. But you know I'd rather be by your side Another night of reaching for you